talking with a student about the flag and I came to discover that they didn't really understand that the former flag was the state's flag. And as a response to that, I felt that it was very necessary that our staff began uh, teaching about the flag so that the students will know that when the election came, this was what it was about. And I'm so elated that we have this opportunity to have a teachable moment for our students so that they can understand that as a Mississippian, this is something that we can be proud of it because this new flag embraces our uh, culture, it embraces heritage, it embraces the history of the state of Mississippi, and it eradicates division. So I thought it was a perfect opportunity for students to learn more about Mississippi and about the flag. I guess I would say I like to learn about the history because I, I never knew that the Confederate flag represented our state. And when my teacher told me and when the principal told me, I was shocked. Like that state actually represents us and I feel that the new state flag will, will be a push in the right direction. We in Jackson Public Schools have, have actually had our scholars quite involved in this latest election of 2020, uh, where uh, we, we work to get young people registered to vote. We uh, work to help them to understand the issues and the candidates and, uh, and all of that you know, from an educational standpoint. And then of course, also on the ballot was uh, the, the flag referendum. And so we're just so excited that uh, our state has ch uh, chosen to, to adopt this new state flag. We believe that it's a signal and a sign of, um, of increased um, acceptance and appreciation for all people and backgrounds. Um, and it's, um, it's, it was the will of the people. And, and so overwhelmingly, the vote was to adopt a new flag.